Hello and thanks for watching this Cloud9 ERP Solutions video and subscribing to our YouTube channel. In this series of videos for Acumatica 2022 R2, we're going to talk about a new ability to be able to enter box dimensions on the fly when you're shipping. So if we create an order and we'll add an item, And now we create the shipment. Under packages, it used to be you'd have to select the correct box. So let's say, for example, we want a large box. You, you get the dimensions from the box. And the challenge we've always had with customers is that if they had custom box sizes, they would have to create a ton of different boxes to get a ton of different dimensions. But now, if we remove this item, you have the ability to change your length, width, and height. And if I ship with this and confirm my shipment, you can see now we have a tracking number and we have a label and it's all based on these new dimensions that we updated. You can see that FedEx converted this into inches. It's what they want to see. If we go back, you'll notice that we had it in centimeters. And just for clarity, if you go into the company's profile and we'll open up our products company, here at the bottom right hand corner, you could see the linear unit of the measure. So here you could change it for your company or configure it that way right from the start. Keep in mind, even though you change your unit of measure, so I'll change this to inches here. And then the next time you pass this along to your carrier, for example, this example here, 28 by 20 by 13 is now in inches. You'll now see a label that'll show the actual dimensions in inches. So that's it. That's the ability to be able to enter dimensions on the fly. Now, instead of having to create all your boxes and rely on the box itself to pass along the dimensions. If you have any questions about this or anything else Acumatica, feel free to reach out to us. We'd love to hear from you. Thanks again for subscribing and have a great day.